Good morning, everybody, and welcome back to another video. Today is Thursday, and the weather is incredible. Yesterday, I was looking at the weather to see what this weekend would look like, and I noticed that today was going to be super duper nice. It is a high of eight kilometer winds, so I decided that I'd call up my dad. He was actually working in Belleville um, and see if we could go out fishing, film a vlog. And he said, sure, why not you go by yourself? And actually earlier this week, he challenged me to film and edit a vlog all by myself. And he said he didn't think I was able to do it. Well, today I thought because the wind was perfect, that I would prove him wrong and film a vlog by myself and then edit it. And so I have a little bit of a plan. It's not that detailed. I'm probably just gonna go for smallmouth bass because uh, it is post-spawn. Opener was a few weeks ago and they're starting to leave the inner bay. So I thought that I would go for smallmouth while I can and see what happens. Let's just get going. Dropping my breakfast everywhere. Okay, it's pretty loud, but I'll tell you anyway. So, as you can see right here, there is a hole. Right there, this long stretch. This is the deepest part of Long Point Bay. So I'm just going to start by fishing the edge of this hole right here. And then I will work my way all along this stretch. That is going to be my starting point. And then later on, I'll probably just go to a sandy flat and try and mark as many weed patches as I can and fish there for a little bit too. Okay, so we are at the first spot now. Let's get going. For baits today, I'm starting off with this VMC spin jig. It's really cool. I've never used it before. It kind of looks like a mixture of a spinner bait and a swim bait. So I thought I'd try that out. And then for my follow-up bait, I have a finesse half moon jig and I have not put a yummy fish on it yet, but I'm going to put a jacko yummy fish on it. I should probably do that right now so that I don't forget and if I see a fish and it follows, then I'll have it ready. And just as a backup, I also have a jerk bait. Hopefully all goes well. Okay, that looks fantastic. You can see that right there. That looks absolutely fantastic. I don't know of a fish that would not want to eat that. Oh, fish, 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 ah. Stad, I'm trying. Oh my goodness. I can't talk, I just see a fish, I see a fish. I gotta go, bye. Oh, oh, he went after it, he went after it. Oh my gosh, he literally went after it. Goodness, oh my goodness. Just eat it, man. Oh, come on, where'd it go? That was crazy. He literally looked at it twice. Guess I'll just have to keep going. Okay, there's been a complete change of plans. I just decided that I'd look at my gas gauge. It is almost empty, as you can see. Quick tip for you folks, always check your gas before you leave. Okie dokie, so the boat is now filled. Uh, I am going to head out in the outer bay and see what happens. Hopefully I'll catch some fish. The water temperature might be a lot different, uh, like I said before, so we'll see. I'm excited, let's get going. Okay, 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 <laughs> okay. So, we 
are at the spot and it is incredibly beautiful here when i say beautiful i mean beautiful that's the shore over there and then look at this flat calm water it is amazing there's not a ripple on the water pretty much oh look at that look at that oh look at that boulder let's mark that mark exit exit we're in 10 feet of water so the contour lines say it's six it's the wires of uh, the wire the water is a lot higher this year than it normally is so okay i can't handle this anymore i just need to get fishing I love using side imaging and my graphs, but sometimes I just need to actually go fishing. Oh, it looks so good. <laughs> oh, fish. Oh, no way. No way, it's a seabed. No way. Oh, oh my gosh. It's a big one. No way. No, no freaking way. That is a big sheephead. Oh, holy cow. Okay, I need a spot like this. Holy cow. This is crazy. This is so cool. Oh, okay, let's grab a minute. This is so cool. Okay, I'm freaking out. Oh, this is crazy. I did not expect that. He bit right beside the boat. Come here, dude, come here. Pull Avery. Yes! No! Yes! No way! Sheep head on the, j on the jig. Oh, oh, wow, that is so cool. Okay, I did not expect that. Did not expect that. Let's unhook him. He bit it, like literally, hopefully you're seeing this, literally right beside the boat. That is so insane. Look at that fish. <laughs> that is awesome. Oh, <laughs> probably gonna grab a quick picture of him and let him go. So. Let's get this guy back into the water. Oh, <laughs> he was ready to go. There he goes. Now, let's see if I can catch a smallmouth bass, the species I came here for. Should have just made this sheephead video. Technically, I could be like, hey guys, guess what? It no longer is a smallmouth video. It is a sheephead video because apparently I can only get sheephead. I mean, every time I go fun fishing, I catch a ton of fish. Every time I go not fun fishing, well, I guess it, it's still fun, but just every time I bring cameras with me when I go fishing, I catch nothing. Fish. Oh yeah, baby. Oh yeah. Oh, this feels like a smallmouth. This feels like a smallmouth. Woohoo! Woohoo! Please be a smallmouth. Please be a smallmouth. It's not fighting very hard. Feels kind of heavy though. I really hope it's a smallmouth. No! 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 It's another sheephead! No way! This is literally sheephead extravaganza here. Oh my goodness, second sheephead of the day. This one's bigger than the last one. Yeah! Second fish of the day in the boat. This one is quite a bit bigger than the last one. Let's get the hook out. Honestly, I thought at first this fish was a smallmouth because it hit so hard and it shook its head so much, just like a smallmouth. But then when it did not jump, I realized <laughs> there's no way this is a smallmouth. And then I saw it flash its side and it was too white on the face to be a smallmouth. It sure is a pretty looking fish though. I don't understand why people think it's garbage fish because they sure do fight hard and they're really nice looking fish. Now, 
Let's get this guy back. Okay. Let's get a nice girl. Release shot. Not underwater release because this can't go. Oh. <laughs> there it goes. It's like 12 o'clock right now. And um, it is really, really hot out. Right now, I am fishing on rock piles with my Ned Rig to see if maybe they're just, whoa, what is this? This is like Bermuda Triangle stuff right here. That is crazy, what is that? I'm getting bit, I think. Got one. I think it's a rock bass. Yes, it's a rock bass. Not the right kind of bass. I mean, it's still bass, but not the right kind. Let's put this guy back and go catch his cousin. Oh, <laughs> that's a tiny rock bass. Bye, dude. Oh, fish. Nope, it's a sheephead too. Are you joking? Where are all my bass friends? I'm just gonna go up here for a second and just cast. Oh, oh, is that a smallmouth? Oh, oh, I think he had it. He had it in his mouth. Got him. No, no way, no. Okay, okay, wait, he's, I think he's still there. Got him, fish on, fish on. Smallmouth, oh my goodness, first smallmouth of the day. <laughs> Let's go, yes, third fish. <laughs> yeah, baby. Okay, where's the net, where's the net? Oh, oh, I'm freaking out. Smallmouth on the Finesse Half Moon Jig. Oh, it's a pretty nice one too. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh. Oh, oh, I'm literally shaking. No way. He hit that thing so hard. Come on. Come on. Come on. Ah, oh, dang it. Almost had him. Almost had him. No. No. Come on, net. Come on, net. Don't be mean to me. Yeah! Let's go. Third fish of the day. Smallmouth on the finesse half moon jig. Look at this guy. This is a nice looking fish right here. This is the species we were looking for. Woo, baby. Oh, that was loud. Did you hear that echo, man? Look at this fish. This is a healthy, beautiful post-spawn fish. Oh, yes. Look at that. Oh, that's awesome. So awesome, okay. Thank you, buddy. Ah, look at that fish. Oh, that excites me so much. Oh, it's beautiful. So, so beautiful. Let's get you. Okay. Back he goes. Hopefully I can get a nice release. Ow, that hurts the floor. It's hot. Here he goes. Woo Let's go. Pat on the back to me. Mm, little dance. I am so excited. Whew. Okay. Okay. Now, I think ah, that feels really good. I've been struggling all day to land a bass, small bass, in the boat. And I have landed one. And boy, does it feel good. High five to my viewers. Woot woot, okay. So it is getting very, very hot. My chesty just overheated. I'm surprised this camera even turned on. Um, everything is overheating. And <laughs> including me, I'm overheating too. It's really hot out. So I think I should probably call her a day. I had a great time. Uh, I only caught three fish, but you know what? It's my first time out filming by myself. And like I said earlier today, 
they don't call it catching for a reason. You don't always catch fish. So I am going to call dad and then head in, probably have a nice cold drink of water because I drank my water and it was very hot. Uh, have a nice cold drink of water and be in my house with the AC on and it is going to be wonderful. I had a great time filming this video all by myself. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please click the like button. And if you would like to see more content like this, please click the big red subscribe button. And always remember to take a game fishing. Like always, you know it. Uh, you know the drill. So we are, I'm gonna head out now. Bye.